Adams coming at you with another video review. Well, uh, not really a video review, but a video that I've wanted to do for a long time nonetheless. Now, as I said, I've wanted to do this for a while, and just because I'm either too lazy or something else has come up, I've put it off and put it off and put it off. Well, no more. I can't put this off any longer. This video has to be made. It needs to be made because this video is not only showcasing a wonderful talent, it's also a very special thank you to what I consider a very good friend. Now what you're seeing is actually a Puggle version of the Back to the Future DeLorean. Now, what's a Puggle? You guys know what the Back to the Future DeLorean is, but what's a Puggle? Well, a Puggle is a little tiny stuffed animal sort of thing that is created of a rather kind of cutesy characters. The Puff Puggles are kind of randomized, just cute little things. But Transformer fans may be a little bit more familiar with Puggle Formers. Now, what's a Puggle Former? Well, a Puggle Former is a cute little stuffed animal thing of our favorite Transformer characters. Now, some time ago, I did have the honor of becoming friends with the creator of this. Callie's Critters, or Callie as her friends just kind of call her, makes these by hand. This was the very first kind of large scale thing that she's really kind of done. And she did a fantastic job. I mean, as you can see, it's got opening doors. It's got the whole time circus there. You flip around here on the back, it says out of time. It's got the uh, exhaust vents. I love the, the little glitter that's on there. Very cool. More time circuits. Now you open the door and it also includes a Marty McPuggle. Yeah, Marty McFly, which just is wonderful. I really love the way that this looks. Now, if you look in close, um, you can kind of see there's the time circuits. Flip around here on the back. It's kind of hard to see, but there you, uh, there you can see the flux capacitor and uh, steering wheel and everything. It's, it's absolutely a wonderful representation. Like I said, she made it all by hand. When I saw these, I fell in love with them. Now, not as much as, you know, my good friend TFG1 Mike, who gets them every other day, it seems, but I really wanted to utilize her talents for something else. That's when I started talking to her about taking some things that are extremely important to me, some critters that are near and dear to my heart, whom are basically like children to me. Now, as many of you know, uh, well, technically, I'm already married, but uh, in November, we're actually having our wedding. Now, my wife and I, we, we don't have kids, but we sort of have kids. We have three gorgeous, loving cats, and we really wanted to bring those cats with us to the wedding, but we can't. We can't have wild animals. Well, not really wild, but crazy cats running around. Louie probably would be fine. He'd probably just lay there and, and do nothing. But Burger and Gracie would go nuts. Now, Burger and Gracie and Louie have all appeared in videos of mine throughout the years. Many of my longtime uh, subscribers and friends and all that kind of stuff, they know about Louie, Gracie, and Burger. Burger being the most recent one added to our, uh, our family. So I contacted Callie and I asked her if she could make cat versions of these little guys. Cat versions that would replicate my actual cats. That way we could have them at our wedding. I thought it was a cute little idea. I thought it was a sweet little idea. And Callie agreed, taking on the challenge, and in my opinion, completely and utterly beating all expectations that I had. So without further ado, let's get this out of the way. And let's introduce you to my kitty puggles. First off, here's Louie. Up next is the smallest of all of them, but the uh, the second oldest in our family, and that would be the one and the only Gracie. And up next, the newest addition to our family, and growing like a weed, here is the Piquito Ambreguesa, or Burr. And here you have all three of them. The little kitty puggles. I was going to call them kitty formers. <laughs> these things are absolutely adorable. I love all of these. Callie did such an amazing job on each and every one of them. Louie was actually a little bit tough. He's got so many different colors to him. You kind of have to pick which ones you're going to go with. But I think she did a wonderful job. He's got his uh, really kind of trademark look here on the top. Gorgeous eyes. I love the fact that she got the white around his nose. Give him a big, huge nose. Beautiful little uh, white triangle chest piece, which he has. I love the fact that she included in the ribbons, that that's the actual color of their collars. Um, the tag little here says, uh, hi, my name is Louie. And then it's got a little tail. It's so cute. That's Louie. Oh, it's my boy. It's my big boy. Oh, so cute. And of course, 
him being the biggest, fattest one, it's re it's reflective here in the actual Puggles themselves. Up next is the little Gracie, who also does have a little pink collar, and I just think that that's so cute. She actually had to hand paint these eyes because they were so tiny, but it says, Hi, my name is Gracie. Just absolutely adorable. It's got her little tail. Oh, it's my little Gracie, it's a baby. And the most rambunctious one of them all, the one and the only, Burger. Again, same color as her collar. And this one, you know, I gotta be honest, this is probably my favorite one. This one just looks fantastic. I love the fact that she captured that little, she's got a little trademark kind of black part here on her nose. It's just, this This is just so adorable. She's even got the little orange bits here, got her little tail. I mean, this is just an absolutely beautiful, beautiful piece. Hi, my name is Burger. It's a burger, the piquito on piquito. Piquito, 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 la, 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 la. Piquito, 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 la, 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 la. <laughs> I just, I love my cats, and I love the fact that now I'm going to be able to have them actually at my wedding in some form. It's absolutely an honor and a privilege that she made these for me. Not only that, but she also thought to include a wedding card. That, that was, I, I, I honestly cannot thank her enough. This is just a beautiful, beautiful thing. Love is patient. Love is kind. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes and always perseveres. Love never fails. And now these three remain, faith, hope, and love. But the greatest of these is love. Open it up, and it says, Paul, God bless your marriage with love, the kind that keeps growing and deepening and finding more reasons to celebrate the beautiful life you begin today. Congratulations. Wishing you and the missus all the best. Callie. Um, that was, and she paid $4.99 for this card. Yeah, you know, it's got this little really kind of cool thing. The, these, you know, the fact that she went ahead and she made these for me and thought to include that. Guys, if you could, I would really appreciate it if you would do a little something for me. Down here you see her, her little websites. I'm going to put them in the video description as well. But please go and check out her DeviantArt, and I, I can't even say what that is. But check out these pages. I'm going to put her Twitter down there too because it's actually, I can't remember her Twitter. But follow her on Twitter. She does commission. She will make some of these for you if you really want. You know, if you wanted a puggle made of Wheeljack, she'd make one for you. Obviously, you know, there's a fee and all that stuff in, involved it's not free but this is a wonderful talent and she really needs a whole lot more recognition for it Callie I cannot thank you enough this is a wonderful and beautiful wedding gift to me I hope you enjoy the video and I hope other people look at this and enjoy your work and go forward with getting more things from you these things are absolutely adorable and as I said I cannot thank you enough so until next time guys this has been Optibotamus with Louie Gracie and Burger <laughs> Saying I'll talk to you later.